Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to configure stable diffusion and load multiple models in Google Collab. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to open three tabs of Google Collaboratory. So I'm going to open three. And once I'm done, I'm going to upload the files. So I have here three files which we are going to work on today. So we have anything version three. Hasn't blend as well as Padoro. Now once you're done opening, so you have here the model code and this is the latest version. This is how you are going to do it in July 2023. So you want to click on the second one. This is the Hassan Blend. Let's scroll down and you see here the model code. We're just going to copy that one and we're going to go to the first one. Here we're going to paste it here. So the same thing with Padoro. Scroll down, you see the model code, you copy that one, and you paste it here. And that's basically it. The next thing that we're going to do is we're going to run the cell. And then we're just going to scroll down here for us to see the progress. So take note that this is going to take quite some time, so I want you to be patient and just wait for the link to appear here. So as you can see here, we now have the public URL. So we're going to open that one. And once we're here, we're just going to check it here. So as you can see, we now have successfully loaded all three models here in Google Lab. So let's try to generate something in order for us to check. So let's say, for example, this is going to type one girl. And with anything version three, let's try to generate it here. Okay, so this is the image that we have generated. Let's try to open it in a new tab. And then let's try to open it with uh, Hassan Blend. Okay, so we have now uh, selected Hassan Blend. Let's try to generate using Hassan Blend. Okay, so as you can see, the image is very different. We're also going to open that one in a new tab. This time we're going to do a side-by-side -side comparison of the image that we have generated earlier from Anything version 3 and as well as from Hassan Blend. So again, the keywords that I've put here in the prompts is just one girl. And these are the images that I got from just typing one girl. So as you can see, they are very different. One is very much animated look. This is from Anything version 3. And the other one seems like it was drawn by hand. That is from Hassan Blend. So yeah, that's how you're going to configure stable diffusion and load multiple models using Google Collab. So congratulations, everyone. I hope you have learned something and have a good day.